hello guys in this video i am going to show you how to enable the option for alarms and warnings message i mean if your inventory is showing any alarm or any warning in the display so if your data logger is got configured already then the warning or alarm alarm notification will be pushed to your email or your mobile number okay so maximum it will send to your email id so how to enable that option okay in this video i am going to show you and as well as uh, if you forget the password if you uh, for example if your installer is uh, uh, arranging you a password you know not liking that so you can change your password yourself for example your if your email id is not working and you randomly kept some other email id for temporary purpose for that now again you want to keep your own email id on your own mobile number how to do those things so in this video i am going to show you all these things okay so first enter your uh, enter the login credentials of your account and click on login so here down we can see user at the fingertip bottom of the screen okay click on user your first option will be like change password click on change password enter the current password of your account and enter your new password what you want to have to what you have have to change okay now go back information management here for example random mail id you get for temporary purpose for example solar technician came and used this email id instead of yours because if you are in some other work so temporary purpose now you can edit that email id and keep your own email id here okay and your mobile number as well and here we can see fault information push so whatever the email id you are keeping here those fault or alarm messages will be went to will go to your email id okay now i am enabling this and confirm you click you can press confirm okay it is not taking because i didn't enter your email okay like this we can enable fault information i mean notification to your email id okay and for example if you want to use some other username and password first of all we have to delete this account before deleting this account we have to delete the plans first so click here and delete like this we have to delete each and every plan later you have to delete the account and later you can create another username and password okay in this way we are going to uh, enable alarm and warning messages notifications to your mail thank you and please subscribe to my channel thank you